everybody, it's Margaret. Welcome to my channel, Texas Gal Treasures, and today I'm bringing you, yes, a sales update video. So, it's been a while. I just got my shops um, put, taken off a of vacation that you may or may not have seen my eBay, like, frustration video, but fickle is woman, right? Um, I got a sale, and so I'm not mad anymore <laughs> for now. Um, so, yeah, the, I thought, you know what? I haven't done a sales update in a really long time, and... I'm going to share my sale from today, but I thought that I would also um, go ahead and share some of my print-on-demand sales so you can kind of see what's been going on with my, pr my print-on-demand stuff. My, my friends that are my patrons, hang on, I got these like bracelet thingies on. We went to this jumpy trampoline place. They're driving me nuts. There we go. Um, hi in the chat. Hello. Hello. Um, so yeah, I thought I'd come on and share that and share my um, print-on-demand sales so you got um, can get an idea of how that's been going for me too. So my first is my eBay sale. My one eBay sale. Since I turned my shops back on, I saw this tie bar um, and it sold for $20.89. So like I said, um, well, I've I've always said my my gateway drug into selling jewelry, my gateway jewelry into selling jewelry has been was men's accessories because you can pick them up super cheap and then they usually flip them for a pretty good profit. So this type art sold today for twenty dollars and eighty nine cents. Buyer paid shipping, so that will go out Monday. I'll probably box it up or you know package it up tonight. So hello, hi in the chat. Thanks for coming to hang out. So that's that. Hang on, let me check because I want to make sure I don't have certain things. Okay, I don't want to show you that. Um, yeah, not too bad. Not too shabby, right? Um, <laughs> so next up, I have, um, I share one of my print-on-demand shops it's called Texas Gal Design. So these ones are generally ones that I've, you know, designs that I've either done in on tutorials with you guys, um, but in, in, in a, the shop that I can use as a, tutorial to do videos about you know if people have questions or anything so I sold these socks <laughs> and I I know they look funky right they're not like amazing and I think these are supposed to be like sublimation socks where you can like do the all over print on them but I did these like tie-dye cats and these socks I can't remember the exact price that they sold for sorry but the profit that I get from these socks is seven dollars so pretty easy for uploading an image I think. Um, and then another sale that I had in my POD was this. So Christmas is on upon us already. Um, this is a Santa, Distress Santa phone case um, that sold. And the profit I'll get off of this is ten, about $10, a little over $10. And if you're wondering about that, um, I've got lots of videos on setting up your Etsy shop. I have multiple Etsy shops. So I've got ones that are for print. Oh, I meant to pull up that other one because I have a um, digital download shop too where I put stuff when I make it for, it's like a, if you're a homeschooler or a teacher, you know, there's a site called Teacher Pay Teachers um, where it's digital downloads and things like that. So I have a shop there, but then I also have my digital downloads that I do on Etsy. Um, so, hey, young, <laughs> you coming to take my ideas? No. <laughs> um, so... I meant to pull that up too, but I just forgot. So I'll see if I can pull it up and show you. Um, it's not huge, but you know, every little bit counts. And it's like, well, if I've already made it for the homeschool classroom, or if I already made it when I was teaching, you know, I just stick it up there. Oh, look, hey, pancakes. There he is. Pancake. Um, <laughs> hi, hi, everybody. Thanks so much for coming. Um, and then hang on, let me see. I'm going to pull up my merch, but I want to make sure it's still like hidden. There's a there's a little way to hide stuff on merch. So these are my sales so far for the month of September. And um, so I've had 30 sales so far in the last week. And so my royalties on merch so far are $131, um, with the average being about $4.38. So not bad. Um, I have been selling some Christmas stuff already and some Halloween stuff. So if you haven't gotten up your holiday things or if you haven't taken them down <clears throat> um, they've started selling for me also what was I gonna say um oh yeah you can see here like what the breakdown is like standard shirts long sleeve pop sockets and premium shirts so standard shirts are still my best sellers for sure um 
and yeah right oh uh, thanks debbie <laughs> uh yeah i'm in the classroom now because i have not finished setting up my workroom in there so this is me on the floor in the classroom um i was gonna say something else and i totally spaced i can't remember all right so let me pull up my um my etsy shop just so i can show you because it i mean my thing is if i've already made it uh, why not just pop it up you know, even if I just put a dollar on it, if somebody downloads it, awesome. Oh gosh, what's the name of my homeschool shop? Is it Homeschool Honey? It might be Homeschool Honey. Find shops named Homeschool Honey. Nope. Zero. Okay, what is it? Maybe I should have done my homework first. Is it still Texas Gal Homeschools? It might still be. Homeschool. Let's see. Aha! There it is. Ta-da! Maybe I need to switch my shop name. So you can see, like, these are the kind of digital downloads. I know I talked about doing a video about it, but I never did. Um, like a weekly check report, like I, my kids can check off what they're doing. And these are calendar pieces that I did, like, for a pocket chart for when I was in, still in the classroom, like, teaching kindergarten. Um, and then, like, coupons, you know, mom's Christmas coupon book. And these are Arrowhead things that I made for the kids when we were doing Arrowhead. So, I mean, it's not like crazy stuff just stuff we already made um and it, so these are some sales that i've had <laughs> two sales now i did i used to have i have had more sales on these one um i used to have these in my texas gal designs where i have all the print on demand stuff um so i have sales that they show up over there but i took them all down and put them over in their own shop just to make it a little easier um, and then also, it's on my teacher pay teacher site, so I get some sales there. So, I mean, it's not huge, but to me, it's like, okay, that's a buck, that's three bucks. All, you know, it all starts adding up. Um, and if I've already done it, why not? Why not? Um, uh oh. Yeah, okay, Young's gonna steal mine. Okay, no problem. No problem. Yeah, anyway. <laughs> so, I don't know. I just wanted to come on and celebrate. <laughs> oh, Debbie, y'all. <laughs> um, because I know I just did a video recently getting really upset with some of the hiccups that I encountered relisting or, or coming out of vacation mode on eBay and I was pretty frustrated uh, and so I was just like letting off steam so <laughs> whatever um, I'm laughing at Yong and them in the chat. So, yeah, every little bit helps, right, Patty? And I just found a lady that's going to come and help me. She put put up an ad in our neighborhood. Um, she she does, she's a house cleaner, but she's also, like, domestic. She, it's like domestic help stuff. I don't know, but organizing, right? So I've been struggling with, I mean, I'm good at organizing, but just time, right? I don't have time. We haven't finished unpacking the house. My workroom is still a crazy nightmare um she charges 25 bucks an hour and so she's gonna come just like so i have an extra pair of hands and there's it's for me personally like it's hard for me to get motivated to like unpack and clean and do things if i don't have somebody else there like i don't know because i just rather not um so then it's like okay if i'm paying somebody 25 bucks an hour even if she comes for an hour like that's gonna get me motivated to get to work and she's gonna help me like sort through stuff, get things situated in the in my workroom. So I'm really excited about that, you know. I'm pretty excited. She came by and talked to me this morning. So I figure it's worth an <laughs> twenty five bucks for an hour of help. So we'll see. Um yeah, absolutely, um Patty. Maybe she has good ideas. I I'm all for it. I mean I'm pretty good at organizing. It's just with everything else, like time is time is of the essence. I don't have it. You know, I just don't. So I'm pretty excited about that. Yeah. Okay. So, um, yeah, cheers to one uh, sale on eBay and many more to come, I'm sure. Um, but, yeah, things are getting back in the swing of things, even if it's one sale. I'm happy with it. So, yeah. Um, I also, oh, oh, if you don't follow me yet, um, click the little bell because some of our friend. oh, I clicked the wrong button. Oh, darn. Um, my chat disappeared. Mm some of our friends do jewelry auctions and i've been talking to cindy um cindy loves jewelry she's an admin over in texas gal jewelry lovers and she's been doing really well with them as well as other people i know that have done them 
And so I'm going to talk to her hopefully next week. I'm going to see, and I want to, um, uh, advertise it so people know when it's going to be right. So I'm going to talk to her and maybe she'll have time to help me or to talk me through it. Um, so I want to try to get one up next week because I think it'd be fun. And obviously there's no better way to start than just to do it, just to like get the first one done um, because I'm nervous about it. And I don't know. I don't know why. Um, so I'm going to try it. Yeah. So make sure um follow me on Facebook, Texas Gal Treasures, and here so that you'll know if you're interested in coming to check it out. So that's it. Um, I'm going to go to the movies tonight. What are you guys going to do? We went to, um, and you know me, Patty, right? I, I'm all about sharing the well, spreading the well, sharing the well. So I know I'm going to give um, give some good deals. She does it on her, on her YouTube channel. So somebody helps moderate in the chat, and she'll hold up stuff and be like, okay, we're going to start the bid at five bucks for this necklace. And people can bid in the chat and then when the thing is over um she sends them a paypal invoice i think that's how it works <laughs> that's how i think that's how it works anyway so i'm pretty excited about it and the gosh knows i have got a ton of stuff in the other room that i can definitely um auction off so um keep 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 your eyes open for that if you're awesome if you're, I just read that. If you're, keep your eyes open for that. If you're awesome, yeah. keep your eyes open for that. If you're interested, is what I meant to say. Um, you know how it is when you're like talking and then you read a word and then that word comes out instead of the word you're like intending to say. Anyway, I'm going to the movies tonight. <sighs> Popcorn. But we're gonna see Teen Teen Titans, I think, the kids thing. Anyway, or participate in. Oh yay! Thanks, Vicky Chick. Um. Oh sweet, sweet. Yeah, I've popped in on a couple. Like I just kind of lurk to watch. I think I said hi in a couple of them, but oh cool, cool. I wonder if a person could do it without somebody helping in the chat, or would that be too hard? I don't know, because I'd hate to like make. I don't know, unless somebody wants to. I'll have to ask her how it goes. Anyway, so it'll be cool. I don't know. I got a lot of jewelry, so <laughs> it's okay with me if I want to, you know, share it out. Okay, okay. I'm gonna go. I'm going to go. But thanks for coming to hang out, you guys. And I hope you have a really good weekend. Um, tomorrow is Saturday. So I'm going to go out and see if I find any treasure. Treasures. Treasures. Okay. Um, have a great weekend, y'all. I feel goofy right now. All right. Have a good weekend. See you later. Bye. Ah. <laughs>